Hey folks, today I've got two very quick tools for working with images for you. I'm going to just show a piece on the tools. They are click and drag easy. You're going to love this. First one is cleanup.pictures. Second one is remove.bg. BG stands for background, but hey, just watch this. I've got the whole screen here so you can see just how easy this is going to be. Let's start with cleanup. It's about removing stuff that you don't want in a picture. So let's say you've got a picture with a group of kids and the situation you're showing or the usage you need is just with one student, right? Where you can crop out other folks if you need to, or you've seen blurring. This is a step up. Check this out. I'm gonna click over on the side and I'm gonna drag a picture into the little box. It turns green, I let it go. Boom, there's the picture. Now. Down below, I've got a brush, and I can change the size of my brush. And this is a deleting brush. It's like a pencil eraser. Now, I have learned that a little bit larger is better because as it takes things away, and that's what we're going to do, we're going to take this little guy's head away. But if you go with a little bit larger on it, then the blurring and the smoothing as it removes it winds up being better. I drug it around. I let go, boom, little guy's head is gone. Sorry, little guy. That's how hard that was. That's it. I can now download this picture just by clicking and doing a download. Boom, it's in the bottom left-hand corner of my screen. Like I said, that's how hard this is. If I didn't like what I did, I could always go back and put it back. There you go, there you are. If you need to zoom in, that's what this does. Also, you can hold the space bar to zoom in. That's cleanup.pictures. I've got this picture now downloaded that I can use somewhere else if I so choose. So that is removing an image, removing some text maybe. For example, let's say you've got a sign and you think this is a cool picture you found and it's got a sign and it goes to a lesson that you're going to use. But you don't want the words that are there, the store this store name is there, something of that nature. You can blur that, you know, crop that out or drag that out, I guess, brush that out. Yeah, brush that out. Let's go with that. And then replace the words to be your message for your lesson. Cool tool. Really, really cool tool. Click and drag, easy to use. Another one, just that easy, is a spiffy little thing called remove.bg. BG stands for background. We're going to remove a background. Again, click and drag easy. I'm going to drag a picture of Ramrod over here, and I'm going to let Ramrod go. Boom, there's Ramrod. Wait a second. There's Ramrod without all the background. Taking away all of the background entirely, just that face. So something, an image you've got, Maybe it's your kid from at, at the park or your kid at Six Flags or something or some busy location and all you want is that smiling face. Click, drag, it does it. And again, you can download it and use it somewhere else. That's it. It's that simple. It's cleanup.bg. It's remove background or remove.bg. Click and drag to use. Simple, fast easy to use in your lessons. Go be awesome.